I've gotten some requests to do a little instructional video on this cover that I did of I, I'll Be Here a While by 311. I put that to the ukulele. So, here we so go. Before we get started, let me tell you about the tuning that I'm using for this. Since I'll Be Here a While is actually on the guitar, I uh, changed the ukulele tuning to the lower four strings on the guitar. E, A, D, G. It's just a little looser than normal strings, or the normal tuning on a ukulele. Um, and it's also easier to tune if you know a guitar. Uh, you can just tune each other, each of the strings on the fifth fret, just like the lower four strings on a guitar. Um, <clears throat> so just get one of those strings to either E, A, D, G, and tune them up all on the fifth fret. So here's the intro. Um, let's start with our index finger on these, the third and second fret of the A and the D string, what is now the A and the D string, and we're only going to be plucking those two strings. Then we go, put your ring finger on the fourth fret of your uh, D string, then you pluck the uh, D and the G open. G, 4th fret of the D, 2, open, 3 on your A, 2 on your A, do the open, hammer on 1, 2, open D. Right. Then for the second rep, goes... So it's the same first half of the second rep. But then you do three times on the open G, fourth fret of your D, three times, two, open. Let's do this part one more time. Okay, so here's the chords for the chorus. Um, first one, we're going to go three on the A, two on the D, two on the G. Second one, seventh fret on the A. 5th fret on the D, 5th fret on the G. Then the last chord is going to be 5th fret on the A, 5th fret on the D, 4th fret on the G. And we just do upstrokes of all of them. Okay, so this third chord is twice as long as the other two chords. So, let's do it one more time. Here's the verse part. Let me show you the chords first, and then I'll tell you what I'm doing a little bit different with the technique. So, first of all, um, the chord, there's only two chords, actually. First one, you're gonna do five on your A string. Four on the D, four on the G. Okay, the next one, I'm gonna do open E, two on the A, two on the D, and then an open G. So I do upstrokes again. I'm using my my ring, uh, my middle, and my index finger to get those three higher strings. Um, and then I'm using my thumb to get the down every other uh, one of the chords. All right, so here's the uh, pre-chorus. We're only using two chords in this. We're using a C, which is the open E. We have the third fret on the A, second fret on the D, 
and then the open G. Then the other one's a G, third fret on the E, second fret on the A, open D, open G. So I just do uh, full out strumming on this, but I do a mute uh, strum on the second and the four. Here's the part that uh, I play during the breakdown, the little bridge in the song. Got the second fret on the A, got the open D, fourth fret on the D, open D, and do that second fret on the A and back to the D. And then it goes to the third fret, your A, open D, open G and back. Just to make sure you know what parts I'm talking about, I'm going to play along with each of the parts that I called. So I hope this video helped out and if you have any questions you can just uh, message me on, on my account.